Hi class! Welcome back to our channel. For this video, I will show you how to find the equation of hyperbola given its graph. So, may dalawa tayong klaseng ng equation for hyperbola. If the hyperbola opens horizontally, ang standard equation natin is x minus h square over a square minus the quantity of y minus k square over b square equals 1. Then, if the hyperbola opens vertically, ang standard equation natin is y minus k square over a square minus the quantity of x minus h square over b square equals 1. Okay, so let's have example number 1. Okay, so as you can see guys, na yung ating hyperbola opens horizontally meaning, ang formula na gagamitin natin is yung x minus h square over a square minus the quantity of y minus k square over b square equals 1. Okay? So, after natin ngayon ma-identify yung formula na gagamitin natin, isahanapin na natin yung ating center, which is yung h and k ng ating hyperbola, and yung kanyang a, b. Okay? So, based dun sa ating graph, yung center ng ating hyperbola is makikita kay negative 3, 3. Tama? So, meaning, ang value ng ating h is equals to negative 3 and yung kanyang k naman is positive 3. Okay? So, next is yung value naman ng ating a. Yung a, guys, that is the distance between the center and the vertex. Okay? So, kung bibilangin natin yan, we have 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, so since the vertex is 4 units away from our center, meaning ang A natin is equals to positive 4. Okay? Next is yung ating B. Yung B naman guys, that is the distance between the center and yung end point ng ating um, conjugate axis. Tama? So, ito yung ating B. So, dito guys, since hindi naman given yung ating uh, conjugate axis, ang bibilang na lang natin is yung distance between nung ating vertex doon sa may point na kung saan dumaan yung ating um, asymptote. Okay? So, kung bibilangin natin yan, 1, 2, 3. So, meaning, ang value ng ating B is equals to positive 3. Okay? So, ngayon, na-identify na natin yung ating center and yung A and B. Pwede na natin ngayon i-substitute yan doon sa ating formula. So, try natin. We have x minus h which is negative 3 then square over a square that is 4 square minus the quantity of y minus k so that's 3 square over b square. So, we have 3 square equals 1. Okay? So, simplify natin to guys. So, we have x minus negative 3. So, since 2 negatives, magiging plus 3 square over 4 square, that is 16, minus y minus 3 square over 3 square, that is 9, equals 1. So, ito na ngayon yung ating um, equation ng hyperbola in standard form. Nakuha ba guys? So, let's have example number 2. So, dito guys, as you can see, na yung ating hyperbola opens vertically, ibig sabihin, ang formula na gagamitin natin is yung y minus k square over a square minus the quantity of x minus h square over b square equals 1. Tama? So, ngayon, identify na natin yung ating center, 
para makuha natin yung value ni H and K at yung ating A and B. Okay? So, as you can see naman, na yung center natin is makikita dito kay um, negative 2 and negative 1. So, meaning, ang value ng ating H is equals to negative 2, then yung ating K naman is equals to negative 1. Okay? So, ngayon, kunin natin yung A. Again, yung A natin is the distance between the center and the vertex. So, kung bibilangin natin to guys, we have 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, so ang A natin is equals to positive 4. Then yung B naman is the distance between the center and nung end point ng ating conjugate axis. So since hindi naman given yung ating conjugate axis, ang bibilangin na lang natin is yung distance ng ating vertex dito sa uh, kung saan point dumaan yung ating asymptote. Okay, so since same lang naman yan. So, pag binilang natin yan, 1, 2, ibig sabihin yung B natin is equals to positive 2. Okay? So, ngayon pwede na natin i-substitute yung ating H, K, and A, and B doon sa ating uh, formula. So, that is Y minus K, which is negative 1, then square over A square, that is 4 square minus x minus h, which is negative 2 square over b square, we have 2 square equals 1. Okay, so simplify natin to. We have y minus negative 1. So we have 2 negatives, so that is positive 1. Square over 4 square, that is 16. Minus the quantity of x minus negative 2. Again, we have two negatives. So, that is plus 2 square over 2 square. That is 4 equals 1. Okay. So, ito na ngayon. Yung equation ng ating hyperbola in standard form. Nakuha ba guys? So, this is the end of our video. If you have questions or clarifications, kindly put them in the comment section below. So, thank you guys for watching. This is Prof. D. I'll catch you on the flip side. Bye!